This is Pet Spaces, and this is the McKamey Animal Center. We're all about finding solutions for pet owners. Here at the McKamey Animal Center, potential adopters have the chance to get to know their pets to be in so-called real life rooms. We have four real life rooms that are designed to showcase animals that might be great pets in your home. Dogs that are already housebroken, that have a place to stay in that's very light and bright. But over the years, the rooms have taken a beating and it's time for an upgrade. We only tiled the walls halfway up and the rest of the walls drywall. So over the four years that we've been using those rooms, the drywall has been eaten by some mischievous dogs or is just started to disintegrate with all the cleaning that we do. So with the help of Tim Mallow from Dakota Tile and material from Crossville Tile, the mission is on. It doesn't take long for the first issues to arise. We just started tearing up the floor, and for some reason along this outer wall, we've got standing water. Tim is pulling the tiles up off the floor, and already there's a bunch of water underneath there, and we're really not sure where it's coming from. Water is a great place to breed bacteria, diseases, viruses can be living under there. It's really quite frightening in a shelter to have something like standing water. All the times you guys rinse and disinfect the room, the water's been running behind the tile, and going under this, under this way. It's wonderful that this is happening right now because it would be a terrible thing for animals to be getting sick and us to not know why, and there'd be all this water we don't know about under the tile. If it's water that's coming from the walls, it'll only go so far, right? That's what we're gonna find out. Stay tuned. And if it's wet over there, then we got other problems. Okay. 